All right. So we got Pikachu and Gengar. All right. No idea how this matchup goes. Um, Pikachu has relatively low lag attacks, so I don't think um, being able to permeate through things is going to be a huge deal for Pikachu to deal with. Um, I, Gengar are probably a high sense of uh, Thunderbolt, so that's going to be shoot. Going for the counter. Ooh. Okay, what kind of combo we got here? Alright, go for a reset. There we go. Nice finisher right there. All oh, damage right off the bat. In the first 10 seconds, half of Heavy Boy's HP is deleted. Alright, so. Ooh, that's a. Oh, I could have started something there. Um. So now he's really getting a lot off of these uh, straight hits here, but now Heavy Boy able to finally get his um, opportunity to get something started here. See how he keeps the advantage going. Going for the charge JY. Ooh, might not have won that, but did get a lot of synergy out of it. And now he's gonna go ahead and pop it first. And now this is Oh wow, the Thunder actually going through right there. Oh man, wow, nice timing there from Heavy Boy. Eevee call mid combo. Whoa, able to continue it. That's cool. Okay, Drashi call. And burst. Yes, I think there's enough catch. No, it won't, but, ooh, Heavy Boy got a little bit answer right there. Oh, man, a lot of trades working out in Heavy Boy's favor. Nice! Okay, keeping the counter going. That was, that was a brave move. Um, but, anyway, there we go. So, now able to take that first round there. Um, I'm wondering how long his speed shoot can last, though. I feel like once Heavy Boy adapts to these tricks, um, he's going to be able to start going a bit crazy against him. All right. So, yeah. All right. So, ooh, wow. That was a very uh, scary uh, volt tackle right there. Almost King hit those out of it. Yeah. Now you can see Heavy Boy. Once he gets to the advantage now, not falling for the tricks. Um, really, really, really able to keep momentum going here. Um, man, you keep seeing these uh, six cards. It just isn't not confirming on Oh, what? Okay. Hit those is really working out right there. And that grab is going to. Deal some damage, take away a lot of that burst. Okay. Probably gonna expect a raw burst right here. Yes! <laughs> wow, it worked. Okay. Um, so yeah, Heavy Boy, unfortunately, is not able to get his homing off. I think he had the right idea, just wasn't able to make it happen. That did a lot of damage. Okay. Uh, rage boost, and the fact that Gengar is a really squishy character. Really not how nice there. Doing the dodge to avoid the second hit. We're gonna see a burst from Heavy Boy. Doesn't need it. Alright, he gets it right there. That counter is not working out. It's not active at all. I think it's only active for like one frame. Um, yeah. I remember, like, I used to think, like, Pikachu's counter is, like, absolutely busted. Wow, hello, ca hello, camera! Ooh, nice anti air call right there. Okay. Let's have to draw you in the back. Could get it right now and get his burst going with a lot of power behind it. Nice volt attack. Okay. That's gonna be big. Goes for the nice. Um, two wide combo there. Alright. Alright, now we have double burst going on. Heavy Boy really is in a tight position right now. Alright. Uh, May Whip, gets himself out of the corner. That's probably worth it in the end. Jirachi coming in. Oh, that could be. Oh, man. That, was huge. that could be a big opportunity. Ooh. No, why are you approaching? Why are you approaching? Oh, it worked anyway. Okay. And it's a new light. And we get that game there. Alright. Now that he's beaten the Gengar, are we going to get a change of pace here from Heavy Boy? I feel like he's going to be able to adapt to this Pikachu. Um, there are definitely a lot of gaps here. Um, I don't think the Pikachu, I don't think his Pikachu is incredibly optimized. I know that there's some combo opportunities in there. He didn't quite get, he's getting a lot off of stray hits um, overall, which is not bad. Like, Pikachu is a character who can throw out a lot, of, a lot of attacks and get little bits of damage here and there and make it all work out in the end. But I feel like Heavy Boy is going to adapt to that. Okay, and let's see how some Poyon matches up. Also, at this point, I would dare say um, his Empoleon is his better character. I think it just it's a character that just fits him so well. And someone who can be really aggressive. I think he really excels in the bait and punish part of aspect of the character. Um, so I'm really, really excited to see him really exploring it. Oh, almost, almost got the punch right there. That would be really cool. Comes to know it. Nice easy day, but not able to make it work out in the end. Almost got the grab as on reaction. Got the combo here from Heavy Boy. Nice ending with the drill pack. Lots of damage already on the board. 
So that's punishable. Oh, but this is Empoleon we're talking about. All right, so backing up, creating some distance, going through the JXs. Oh, nice. Iron Tail actually going over the middle level hitbox. He can burst that. Oh, he can burst that. Oh, gets the debuff right there. That's going to be huge. Uh, this, oh, nice Volt Tackle. I think Kevin was probably trying to bait out a burst attempt right there. What's the option? What's the option? Goes in for burst. Nice amount of chip. Ooh, the drill pack. Really working out right there. Nice from Zanelli. Really trying to make it as far as he can. Ooh, he actually gets it. All right. What's, what's the option? What's the option? Nice bait. Oh my god, Zanelli. Really, really just baiting out all these options here from Headboy. Hank gets a bolt tackle. Okay. Uses the drop to get as much synergy as he can right now. If he wins his field base, he's definitely getting his burst again for attempt number two. All right. So close, so close to it. Oh my god. Getting himself out of a really tight situation. Oh, come Aqua Dead there. This is this is dangerous. This is dangerous. This is either player's game. You know it's so close to getting this burst. There he got Oh man. He went for the, he did the right thing. Trying to see AC those projectiles get his burst. But I think he, he was just so close. If he could have got gotten his burst out, could have gone for it, got the chip, and just done almost just enough to get him to win that timeout. He'll be going to counter that time. Alright, now what's gonna be his camp action here? Hey boy, just going for all these uh, JY setups. Really abusing that aspect of the character. Oh man, gets that full meaty counter. Just double six flies. Oh man, that is really something for that grab. Alright, so the burst coming out. Draw you? Yep, alright, a lot of damage now on the table. Oh, that's Spongebob. Wow, that that changed directions. Okay. Doing the low I'm not quite sure what that does. Ooh, this could be huge here. And okay, goes to the reset. Goes to the reset. Waiting for something. First, oh, there it is. I, I don't think that'll do it, but it's gonna put Edward in a really tight position right now. And with low on his meter, he's gonna need a really, really good confirm. You know, I just need to be patient. Wait for this burst to get out, or just go straight in. Oh, that's fun. I'm uh, not sure that was punishable fight, but definitely not the greatest idea there. Wow! Amazing instant JX going over the Aqua Jet. Jeez, okay. So now it's really looking good right now. Um, Howard, this is still on round three, game two. So anyone's game. Ooh, really calling for that Rock Smash. All right, so now here comes the Rock Smash um, Turbo Edition. Going straight for it. Rock Smash. Ooh, actually goes for the um, cut. And it goes for all this damage. Combo setup. Gets the wall splat. So no, it's really not looking too great right now, but he does have a Rage Powered Boost. Jirachi is on the way. He does snag that. Okay. He just needs a couple confirms. Oh, that's that going to be it. Oh, no, goes the grab. Probably a missed input right there. Oh, lights! Oh, God! Oh, that's gonna be huge right there. Okay. Still, Zanelli still has quite the hill to climb here for this, um... Against this Empoleon, but that could be what he needs right now. Let's go for triple six wise. Gets Jirachi. If he wins this field, he's gonna get his burst. Okay, go for Thunder. He's going for Thunder. That's gonna be it! Oh, right there. Heavy Boy takes game two. Going... Gonna be a close set. Now, are we guys is gonna keep the Pikachu? It's doing pretty well. It definitely um, could win him this fight, but I can definitely see um, whenever your um, head boy gets some advantage going, I think he's gonna be able to keep it really well. But anyway, going straight to the real deal turtle. Straight for the Blastoise. See how this goes now. The big boy himself. Alright, definitely, I really like watching Denali's boss voice. I feel like it's improved so much. Um, I know it's definitely his favorite character. He really, really identifies with this character. It just really resonates with him. I think it's really, really good for him. Just trying to find some sort of option here. Nice rock smash, able to get him right where he wants him. Oh, 
Oh yeah, these rock shots are really getting a lot of mileage here. Against the no, I don't. Okay, what's the reset opportunity? Again, another rock smash, um, Oki. Oh man, Zanella just keeps pressing buttons. Cannot get this penguin off of him right now. <laughs> just goes straight into JX. He goes, he, he got mad. I can see the Zanella got a little bit frustrated right there. And that's one of, um, Heavy Boy. Heavy Boy definitely plays to, um, in a way that can really frustrate the player, or a player, because he he'll, he'll just keep doing things until he, until they stop working. And now, you know he's got some advantage going right now. See if he can keep it. Okay. Interesting pick with the nine tails. I really want to hear his um why he goes for nine tails. That's an interesting pick. All right, ooh, nice big dance. That defense debuff really putting a lot of work. Going for the grab setup. That defog really baited out an option right there. Man, keeps going for those rapid speeds on those defogs, but this never works out. Heavy Boy really um, adapting to this Blastoise and taking a very swift game three. All right, going to game four. Heavy Boy in the advantage. Really looking good right now. That Blastoise really just could not get anything started. Those rock smashes really hurting him in the long run. All right, but still, this is still so now I can still put him this back. He just needs to get comfortable. Just needs to, uh, once he gets in, once he gets in on a good field phase, he can probably start getting some damage in. He just needs to make it happen. But with all these Rock Smash setups and all of these um, wake-ups he's just not getting, really, really struggling. I, I really don't think Evil Tall's doing anything for him. It's not helping him in those situations where he really needs some help. Gets the hard knockdown. Go for the Dragon Pulse. Oh, the Ice Beam being it out. Right, goes for the rapid spin on block. Ooh, beats it out. Defog not working that time. Go for the bubble. Ooh, I think it beats it. I guess um, because uh, Blastoise got hits that destroys your projectiles. So. Oh, here's a combo opportunity. The bubble setup. Okay. Going for the rapid spin. Losing some advantage he, got, he had before. Being a little rapid spin heavy right now. Ooh, nice, nice. There you go. Hold, hold up your shield. Hold up your shield. Nice. Wow, that beat out the camera. Was the rap uh, the water pulse? All right, so now, oh man, yep, baited out that rapid spin with the ice beam. Definitely a closer game there, but Heavy Boy really looking to be in control of this match. Nice ice beam right off the bat, not letting him get anything set up. That's a counter. Right, gets a nice combo going here. Ooh, that did a lot. Ooh, okay, this. Oh, drops a combo, unfortunately. Ninetales setup, what is this? What is this? What is any of this? Right. Yeah, I, Heavy Boy is really playing to beat out um, the Snow White's habits here. Going for the Evil Tall. Nice water pulse setup there. And we got the burst. Now, Oh, this is a big damage burst. All right, gets a little conversion with the 6Y. He needs to keep this advantage going right now. And every boy really getting him all those off jets. I think you know, he can really adapt um, and anticipate playing reactionary instead of um, aggressively. Because whenever he goes aggressive, every boy is out there with those aqua jets. All right, so this is a really, really tight situation here. Goes for the burst, what's the option? All right, does hit shield. Go from straight for forward Y, okay. Risk the move, but ah, that water pulse not working. Hey boy, being incredibly aggressive, taking that, and he'll be going to grand finals on the loser's side. You know that with a solid third place, however. Highest he's gotten in a paid weekly, so very, very good stuff from him. Really nice, um, and the fact that he could get to winner's final, really great accomplishment for him, so really, really good work on his end. Now, I have to go play grands.